Abdul Kalam. Of all Packer Jainal Abdeen Abdul Kalam, October 15, 1931, July 27, 2015, was an Indian aerospace scientist and statesman who served as the 11th president of India from 2002 to 2007. I have chosen for you the best quotes by Abdul Kalam. Let us sacrifice our today so that our children can have a better tomorrow. You have to dream before your dreams can come true. If a country is to be corruption free and become a nation of beautiful minds, I strongly feel there are three key societal members who can make a difference. They are the father, the mother, and the teacher. To succeed in your mission, you must have single-minded devotion to your goal. Teaching is a very noble profession that shapes the character, caliber, and future of an individual. If people remember me as a good teacher, that will be the biggest honor for me. Excellence is a continuous process and not an accident. Science is a beautiful gift to humanity, we should not distort it. The purpose of education is to make good human beings with skill and expertise. Enlightened human beings can be created by teachers. To become unique, the challenge is to fight the hardest battle that anyone can imagine until you reach your destination. War is never a lasting solution to any problem. Great dreams of great dreamers are always transcended. Poetry comes from the highest happiness or the deepest sorrow. Great teachers emanate out of knowledge, passion, and compassion. Do we not realize that self-respect comes with self-reliance? For me, there are two types of people, the young and the experienced. I was willing to accept what I couldn't change. In a democracy, the well-being, individuality, and happiness of every citizen are important for the overall prosperity, peace, and happiness of the nation. No religion has mandated killing others as a requirement for its sustenance or promotion. For me, there is no such thing as a negative experience. If you want to shine like a sun, first burn like a sun. While children are struggling to be unique, the world around them is trying all means to make them look like everybody else. Look at the sky. We are not alone. The whole universe is friendly to us and conspires only to give the best to those who dream and work. We should not give up and we should not allow the problem to defeat us. Man needs his difficulties because they are necessary to enjoy success. If four things are followed, having a great aim, acquiring knowledge, hard work, and perseverance, then anything can be achieved. Never stop fighting until you arrive at your destined place, that is, the unique you. Have a name in life, continuously acquire knowledge, work hard, and have the perseverance to realize the great life. Life is a difficult game. You can win it only by retaining your birthright to be a person. Climbing to the top demands strength, whether it is to the top of Mount Everest or to the top of your career. The youth need to be enabled to become job generators from job seekers. Let me define a leader. He must have vision and passion and not be afraid of any problem. Instead, he should know how to defeat it, 
most importantly, he must work with integrity. Creativity is the key to success in the future. And primary education is where teachers can bring creativity in children at that level. Unless India stands up to the world, no one will respect us. In this world, fear has no place. Only strength respects strength. Be more dedicated to making solid achievements than in running after swift but synthetic happiness. Ultimately, education in its real sense is the pursuit of truth. It is an endless journey through knowledge and enlightenment. Educationists should build the capacities of the spirit of inquiry, creativity, and entrepreneurial and moral leadership among students and become their role models. Where there is righteousness in the heart, there is harmony in the house. When there is harmony in the house, there is order in the nation. When there is order in the nation, there is peace in the world. I firmly believe that unless one has tasted the bitter pill of failure, one cannot aspire enough for success. The economy forced me to become a vegetarian, but I finally started liking it. The widespread use of antibiotics promotes the spread of antibiotic resistance. Smart use of antibiotics is the key to controlling its spread. Building capacity dissolves differences. It irons out inequalities. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the bell button to receive all new.